What's going on? It's day 56, baby. Oh, of me being on a relaxed plant-based diet, of me exercising, practicing intermittent fasting, just getting healthy in general. I'm out here on Dead Man's Trail, straight uphill, great cardio, and I'm proud of myself because there's no bone in my body that wants to be out here right now. Not even one, not even one, but here I am. Here I am, not just walking, walking on this big old hill, getting a, getting good cardio in. And why, why do I, why am I doing it? Because I want to live, I want to live. There's been no shortage of people in my life that have died uh, because they didn't live right. There's no shortage of people that are in my life that are sick right now that can not benefit from living a more healthy life, including myself. I don't want to just exist. I want to live and I want to do things. You know, I know this. God helps people that help themselves. And uh, I know a lot of people think your life's all planned out, but we don't know that plan. You know, and I think self-will probably has a lot to do with us not living out that plan. And uh, I'm filled with it. I'm filled with it. But uh, I really think this is God's will for me right now to be out here walking, doing my best, trying to get healthy one more time. One thing that I've noticed, been a lot harder this time. Harder this time. You know, there's in the past I've just shred the weight uh, just like that. And uh, this time that's not happening. And I think God's trying to show me, hey, this has got to be it. This has got to be it. Uh, so he's making it a little tougher on me. Uh, and I make it tough on myself sometimes too because I'm not perfect. I don't want anybody to think that. I'm not. Uh, let's do the best I can. But I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. Keeping meat out of my diet. Keeping dairy out of my diet. All that stuff. You know, eat uh, fruit in the morning. Most mornings. Eat vegetables for lunch. And then, you know, some kind of, you know, tofu. Some kind of vegetable base. A lot of times rice. So I eat, I eat plenty of grains, I think. The only thing I shirk on is beans. And I can work on that. There's always room for improvement. Always things to work on. Things like that. You know. But uh, you know there's. Uh, the reason I want to do this. Is because I want to live. And I want to live healthy. And I want to be able to do some things. Yesterday I took the kids to Six Flags. And uh, for the very first time. And uh, you know my entire history. I didn't write any rags. I was grandpa. Uh, matter of fact, I t they would tell me what ride they were going on next, and I and they're getting old. They're older, they're a little bit older. So I told them, "Go ahead and go up there. I'll catch up with you." That's where I'm at with all this exercise and eating right and stuff like that. I'm still still got a long way to go. Uh, I was glad to take them. I was glad to be there. Glad to watch them have fun. But uh, I've had enough of watching people have fun. I want to have some fun too. And the only way to do that is to do this right now. And even though I don't have a bone in my body that wants to, I got to. Didn't get as much walking in this week at all. And that's why I don't think just exercise is a good plan. It's not for me anyway, at all, at all. Because there's some weeks, like this week, my boss was in town and stuff like that. And I didn't get any walking in during the day, hardly at all. And uh, that really cut down my... And then plus I had to probably work a little later here and there. And, uh, you know, life just showed up. Life just showed up. So, uh, and that's what happens. Now, this week, I hope to walk more. I, uh, there's some examples of what's going to happen this week, though. It's supposed to be 94, 95 degrees tomorrow. 
how much walking am I going to get in that day? You know, I won't be able to walk at lunch for sure. You know, so that's why what you eat is so important. Because some days you just might not be able to get out there. You know, so I'm going to be honest, just haven't felt like doing it. And on those weeks, you got to force yourself. Now, I did force myself out there a few times. I, there's only one day I didn't do anything. Or maybe two days I didn't do anything. I decided to do something else Friday other than exercise. I got a little bit of activity in, but uh, it wasn't what I normally do, which is walk. Walking is so good for you. And that's why I do it a lot. Um, it's day 56. Tomorrow's another, and this is the end of another week. And I'll have more on that tomorrow. Uh, I hope everybody has a good night. And uh, today I just want to live, man. I want to live. I don't want to be sick. I don't want to have a heart attack. And the research will tell you that if you're on a plant-based diet, you just won't have one. I don't. I want to stay away from stomach cancer and prostate cancer and, and stuff like that. And the research will tell you that a lot of that's caused by meat, especially red meat. Uh, you know, I, uh, I don't want to have high blood pressure. I don't want to have type 2 diabetes. And I know for a fact from past history that this is the best strategy to stay away from all of that stuff. And that's what it's about. What's, I got it. What, here's what I got to say. What's more important to me? All the food I want to eat or living. All the food I want to eat are these grandchildren. All the food I want to eat or my wife. All the food I want to eat are all the cool things I want to do. You know, that I still can do. You know, uh, I'm already enough of a grumpy old man. You know, I don't need, I don't need to be uh, an obese grumpy old man. And trust me, it makes me grumpy. And uh, that's why I'm out here. So grateful. That's all I have.